So it's Friday the 13th, and it's very important that I think people really understand the origin of Friday the 13th. It started back in the 13th century, I believe. It's when the Templars were being uh, persecuted by the Catholic Church. They, uh, long story short, the king of France, I believe it was, I think it was the king of France, he actually owed huge amounts of money to the Templar Bank, and he had no way of paying it back. So he created a second pope, and he was a pope that was just in France. And he created, uh, the, instructed the pope, because it was a puppet pope, to put all these charges against the Templars. And many of them were able to escape uh, prosecution, and some of them were not. Hey, there's one of those elf cars. Uh, anyway, the Grand Master of the Templars at the time was a fellow named Jacques de Molay, and they captured him. There's a whole bunch they captured, and they just tortured him. I mean, you talk about getting medieval on somebody. That's what they did. I mean, it was absolutely just terrible. The uh, horrors that they visited upon these uh, these fellows. So none of them would confess. They tortured them, but none of them would confess to these crimes that they just these charges against them that were just made up for the purpose of getting out of paying the debt. Because the uh, Templar army was pretty very big. Well. The Friday the 13th, where that comes from, is from this spot in history. They took, uh, tortured and beaten badly uh, Jacques de Molay, and they tied him to a stake, and they were going to burn him alive. That's the type of thing they do back then. And it was on a Friday the 13th, and Jacques de Molay basically cursed them. He said, something to the effect of uh, this will come back around and get you and this will be a day that will bring you bad luck for forever and then the flames consumed him so that's the actual origin of the superstition about Friday the 13th it has nothing to do with ghosts and goblins or you know anything like that it uh did occur, you know, a lot of hauntings and stuff like that, I don't want to get off track here, but highly emotionally charged things usually can cause problems, but anyway, obviously, being burned at the stakes is a pretty heavy deal, so that is the origin of the Friday the 13th superstitious uh, phenomena, so anyway, have a happy Friday the 13th, and don't burn anyone at the stake today, Gah!